Okay, you can add friend of the show, Emmett Smith, to the Army. Mike Fisher reporting on your Dallas Cowboys from the home of the Cowboys in Frisco. Mark down Emmett, the latest Dallas Cowboy legend who finds the state of today's Cowboys to be, as he puts it, and I quote, frustrating as hell. Uh, you've heard a bunch of these guys visit with us here on the Fish Report. Uh, you've heard us talk about it too. Drew Pearson expressing disillusionment with quarterback Dak Prescott, the $40 million disappointment. Troy Aikman calling this year's failure heartbreaking. Deion Sanders, exclusive, exclusive here, saying the Cowboys choked, not built for the moment. There's an army of Hall of Fame Cowboys who remain stunned at the inadequacies of the modern editions of the team. And now here comes Emmett. He's talking on ESPN San Antonio radio. It's frustrating as hell. All-time leading rusher. You see great talent being wasted. You see time passing. Cowboys finished 12 and five. You know that. They won the NFC East. You know that. Amid high hopes, entered the playoffs with a home game as a favorite. You know that. And then they got upset by the 49ers and now all hell has broken loose. I saw somebody say, uh, this, is, this is like a highly unusual cowboy offseason. Is it? They weren't as good as they thought they were. They got salary cap crunch issues and they got a little sprinkling of scandal. That's every offseason around here. Bottom line here, Dallas hadn't been to a Super Bowl since the 95 season when Aikman and Sanders and Emmett were all featured on that team. Quote from Emmett, are we going to just take all this talent and waste it over three and four and five year time frames, assuming and expecting to do something great by doing the same things over and over and over again? Poke at Jerry? And fans are just going to get more and more frustrated with Jerry, with the team, and everything. Emmett's like the rest of us. We don't exactly have an easy fix. But Emmett's got a great anecdote from our old friend, friend of the show, the late, great Joe Avizano, the old special teams coach. Emmett says, as Joe used to say, it catches up to you when it catches up to you. That sounds like Marsha's uh, favorite saying. Marsha, what's your favorite saying? To get rid of the stress, you get rid of the stress. In other words, if you don't eliminate the little foxes in the vineyard, says Emmett, the little foxes in the vineyard are going to eat up all the doggone grapes, and the grapes will be gone, and the years will be gone, and you're going to find yourself starting over again with no wine. Foxes and grapes, and Emmett and Avizano, and Dion, and Drew, and Aikman. I think we've pinpointed the pain. I think we've pinpointed the ailment. I don't think yet we've figured out the right medicine. Although some of those uh, Emmett Smith crushed grapes sounds pretty good to me. Fish, out.